When you are practicing the presence of God, when you are practicing positive Christianity, you are expecting good. So many do not expect good. They expect the worst to happen, and often it does, because they bring it to themselves. In the Bible it says, I pray that the sharing of your faith may promote the knowledge of all the good that is ours in Christ. Well, I pray that you expect good in your life. I pray that you acknowledge it and that you welcome it. I pray that you're receptive to God's guidance and you expect your life to unfold in a, in a harmony and an orderly way. You expect the right way to open for you in the manifestation of your good. Why? Because you're connected with God, and God will bring the good into your life. In human mind, you remove any of the ifs that would act as barriers to a right outworking. God is always willing for you to succeed. And now is the right time for your success. You allow your life to progress to God's perfect plan by trusting the activity of the Spirit in God in you. And you know that it is not the ifs of the human mind. If this were so, then it would happen. If this would happen, then it w if this person would come into my life, then it would happen. No. God is in your life right now. And therefore, you can expect good right now. No ifs, ands, or buts. So often in human mind, we outline the details of how our life should be. And we also outline in our prayers, we say that this can't happen unless this happens first. Then this has to happen. Then this has to happen. And then maybe 79 years from now, I can expect my good. You can expect your good right now because you are a spiritual being and God is connected with you. And God will bring good into your life. You allow God to show you how marvelous life can be. You call upon the inner strength, knowing that you possess and you can expect good outcomes in all of your endeavors. You anticipate that the people that you encounter will be friendly and helpful. You envision good filling your life, and all this you do as you acknowledge the good of God and the good that God brings to your life. And it's important in your free will that you welcome it without any ifs. All blocks are down. You now accept your good.